Hello people of the internet, this is the Geek Gaming Culture channel, more or less the soapbox or the gaming channel because this has to do with gaming but we have to get this out. Yeah, I was going to do a special report on this or a shadow report on this, however the information right at the moment is a little sketchy, however it is also pretty important that people are aware of it and at least somebody gets a video out to discuss what is going on. So Horizon Forbidden West has been released for the PlayStation 5, of course assuming you can even find the ps5 anywhere what is going on with this chip shortage i want to be able to talk about what my frustration is right now and to why we still have a chip shortage two years after the fact that we knew there was one however let's get to the basis of this video which is that some people are now reporting that horizon for bedroom west is breaking people's ps5s this is one coming from the mega chloe this is a random user on twitter saying i break my ps5 by having horizon running under two profiles at the same time ask playstation can y'all help me they do respond saying happy to help do you please share would you please share more details are you receiving any error code or message remember you can also visit our support site and they give the link there that is not the only one though there's another one right here saying devastated isn't the word was loving horizon forbidden west until it bricked my ps5 tried every option but nothing worked so i've had to factory reset 10 hours of gameplay wasted. Not to mention every other game save data I've played since getting my getting the PS5 gone. Heartbroken. And there are some more tweets here. Uh, this was compiled by a user called We Are Nim. And here's another one that says, Ask PlayStation Horizon for Brandon West appears to have pricked my PS5. PS5 powered down after selecting to load the game off the main menu. I followed all safe mode options and it won't get past opening PS logo on boot up just gives a black screen. Screen. This is actually pretty dangerous if it's breaking the PS5. It seems like some people are able to recover their system completely. Some are able to get it back to factory reset and some is probably they might have to get a new PS5 even. This is bad. This is really bad if it's true. And there was one last one saying was literally in the middle of tweeting how much I was enjoying Horizon Forbidden West when my PS5 you know what bed and now it beeps won't, won't turn on. Hmm. Goes on the state. So update ps5 console is dead clean inside but hardware failed it just out of warranty of course so sony will charge me 200 dollars to fix it after a year of use what a fun product hard to find dies after a year and of course there's a gift right there uh so yeah this is not good now there's no official statement by sony just yet as to what could be going on and we are nim goes on to state the sitting several tweets now that horizon forbidden west is breaking ps5 can't confirm it but one tweet says the console rebooted after loading a save game and now it doesn't get past ps logo be safe out there gang and this seems to be only happening with this particular game as far as we are aware there is no other game that is breaking a ps5 right now however this is extremely dangerous there's a few people who are saying hey their system is getting bricked completely they're not able to power on or anything after they're trying to play this game after they're trying to load a save file what is going Going on here is this something that sony needs to address now this is going to be extremely serious that maybe deserves a signal boost which obviously i'm doing now keep in mind that this again is a bit of speculation that this is happening because of this particular game however this is sort of a growing concern right now because there seems to be more and more tweets that are saying hey this is going on it could be maybe these particular users had their system bonked beyond belief at that point or maybe there was something they were doing wrong or maybe it seemed to be brick and something else was getting them that system failure or maybe there's something wrong with the hardware of the ps5 that we're just now finding out but why now what is going on Sony? what is happening because keep in mind this particular system is very hard to find it is seem like every time we see a new restock for the ps5 it sells out within seconds seconds and there's really no excuse at this point especially after a year and a half maybe maybe more than that of the ps5 being out and many people being able to acquire one at least legitimately we don't know about the bots or anything like that but we've been around this chip shortage for how long now and we still don't have a solution there there's got to be something else going on there has to be something else that's causing this to go down like this 
and that's making the PS5 being hard to find as it is. But now you're getting people saying that their system is being bricked, and if it's being bricked to the point where they have to send it to PlayStation for some repairs and they can't do anything about it, are they ever going to get a PS5 back? Are they ever going to get a new one? That is extremely deadly for a PR person to have to shift through. And whether or not it is something that is in the hardware that is failing now, or if it's something in this particular game that is not sitting well with the hardware of the PS5, which remember, this was announced at launch of the PS5 when we first found out about the PS5. This was one of the games that they were touting when we first found out the PS5 was a thing. So what is happening here? So yes, I am agreeing with We Are Nim. Be safe. Don't pre-order games. This has been something we've been advocating for for a while now, but yet people are still pre-ordering games. And to the people who are in the media who were more concerned about appropriation or stuff like that from this game than to actually talk about something that might actually ruin somebody's system, why were you not reporting on that? Why were you not worried more about this and trying to protect consumers from a possible problem if they play this game on their system? Do we know whether or not it's the digital only edition or the disc edition or something that's going on on both of them? Why were you not calling Sony out on this? Why was the whole social justice thing the only thing you were concerned about with this game? But of course, let's not worry about something that consumers and customers are actually going to care about. And let's worry more about our politics. Let's worry more about something that will divide people instead of something that everybody's going to be concerned about on a grander scale. I'll be worried more about whether or not the game is going to brick my system to the point that I can't play it anymore, more than whether or not someone might have the slimmest little amount of detail that I might not be completely in agreement with. I'd be a little bit more concerned about whether or not a game is going to completely destroy my hardware. But no, not to these people, not to the establishment gaming media. Media, not to these people. So those people who were complaining more about what Alloy looked like or what was going on in the game as far as social matters are concerned, you are just as much to blame as Sony is to not addressing this, assuming they will at all. I would hope that they would. Maybe the tweet Chloe was a step in the right direction and maybe they're taking notice of this now. Maybe that's something to be hopeful about, but we need a little bit more action here. So yeah, I do agree with We Are Nim and keep in mind we don't know whether or not this is just on the digital edition or if it's on the disc edition or if it's widespread amongst both of the versions of the PS5 but given that this is breaking a system in which is hard to find as it is because of a chip shortage which seems sus at this point I have to say that maybe this is the worst time for something like this to start occurring Sony you must address this now this is the Geek Gaming Culture Channel saying that just happened